Illinois got the wishbone this Thanksgiving, celebrating a rare Big Ten championship on their home field. But they followed the same script as they have all year long, making it tough down to the bitter end. Quarterback Kurt Kittner making his final Memorial Stadium appearance a memorable one against arch rival Northwestern. 33 of 43, four touchdowns, nearly 400 yards. Brian Hodges and Walter Young pulling in scoring passes on the way to a 17-13 lead at the break. Wildcat Zach Kusta kept pace with Kittner, but the third quarter making the difference. Big play man Brandon Lloyd hauling in not one, but two scoring strikes. 34-13, good guys after three. That's what you get when, when you go, when, when I get one person on me. I mean, this is what you get when you don't double, you know? But never say die, Northwestern wasn't finished. Kusta connecting with Sam Simmons, then Patrick Kunle to make it 34-28. But the Illini defense made it stand up, and it was time to celebrate. Big 10 chance, boy. Big 10 chance, baby. Number one. We can be something special. Not many people believed it. Our fans believed it. Our players believed it. And that's all that matters. Ten and one should speak for itself. That, I mean, that, that's a that's a great record, you know. And uh, I mean, it just feels so good to, to be champion and just bring it to Champagne. So now, I don't know if the basketball team can do it again. Then we we'll, we we'll have two uh, Big Ten champs in, in one year, and that would just be awesome. I want to come to my home school and turn a program around. So uh, me and the, my class that's graduating now, uh, we came in. We all stayed in the same complex. So they, we just told each other like we're gonna win a Big Ten championship before we graduate, man. And we did. We are the Big Ten champs, so I mean, yeah, it feels good. When uh, I see it in the newspaper on TV, it'll sing in a little bit more. But right now, I mean, we expected to win. We expect to be here. You can't end your career at home on a, on a better note. Winning the Big Ten championship, playing a great game against Northwestern. With the win, this edition becomes only the fourth Illinois team ever to win at least 10 games, clinches at least a share of the Big Ten championship, and now must wait until December 9. That's D-Day. And the Fighting Illini will find out their New Year's Day destination. The final at Memorial Stadium, Illinois 34, the Wildcats 28. Chris Whitlick, Channel 3 News, Champaign.